I'm Katrina Cotton for Investment Pitch Media. Manganese X Energy announced two major milestones have been achieved by Cometco Research, thereby successfully completing its third and final processing metallurgical phase for the Battery Hill Preliminary Economic Assessment. These milestones are part of a leading-edge purification process, which are pivotal to completing the company's Battery Hill PA being undertaken by Wood PLC. As the company moves toward producing high-grade manganese battery material for the EV and storage energy markets. Those of you unfamiliar with the John Wood Group PLC, commonly known as Just Wood PLC, it is one of the largest and most respected consulting and engineering firms in the world, with 40,000 employees worldwide. It trades on the London Stock Exchange with a capitalization in excess of 2.7 billion Canadian dollars. We have Martin Ketman, the company's CEO, with us today to address the significance of this news and discuss what investors can expect in the near future. Welcome, Martin. Thank you, Katrina. It's nice to be back on Investment Pitch and to tell all the viewers more about our company, which we are really very proud of and we're really progressing well. To start off, for those of you who are not familiar with our company, Manganese X, Energy Corp, our mission is to become the first publicly traded exploration company to commercialize manganese in both Canada and United States by producing high grade battery materials for the EV and backup energy storage industries. To complete our mission, we are advancing our preliminary economic assessment, which is known as a PEA, and which measures the commercial and economic viability of our manganese battery hill property located in Woodstock, New Brunswick, Canada, which by the way, is considered one of the largest manganese properties in Canada <clears throat> and the United States. And we're very proud of this. Now I'd like to provide some highlights from our, from Manganese X's February 1st news release laying out how Cometco, the metallurgical research and development company we work for, with and for, for the last four years, recently achieved two major milestones, which herald the successful completion of its third and final processing metallurgical phase, leading up to our Battery Hill PEA. These are very important milestones to us, which are part of a leading edge purification process are absolutely pivotal to completing our PEA, which is being undertaken by the highly recognized engineering and consulting firm Wood PLC in our mission to produce high grade manganese battery material for the EV and backup storage energy markets. In the first of the two milestones, Cometco developed a novel and innovative purification process through its test work by eliminating one of two major purification steps, which is major to us for, from the economics point of view, potentially creating major savings for our Battery Hill project. The other major milestone achieved by Cometco was that of producing final crystal products with all, yes, all contaminants below 100 ppms which is so important to the cath battery cathode, including calcium and, and magnesium, which is a crucial threshold level for high grade battery materials. It goes without saying that we are so proud of our company and how we have advanced over the last five years and that we very much appreciate the efforts and accomplishments of Cometco. We would not have developed this groundbreaking technology, including taking our battery hill carbonate and purifying it into 99.95% purity. I would also like to point out something very important in line with our dedication to achieve environment friendly and more efficient cost-effective methodologies, which, which is we do not use highly toxic selenium, yet used by some of the high purity manufacturers worldwide in order to reduce their production costs. Further given that this new lab proven process is very favorable 
to scaling up to validate our concept. We may transition into a pilot project immediately following our PEA, and that's my real hopes and aspirations. So to sum it up, we are very optimistic about Manganese X's future, especially given that Manganese will be a very high demand commodity for battery chemistry as more and more manufacturers move away from using cobalt. Remember that 90% of all high purity manganese sulfate is currently produced in China. We don't want to be dependent on one country to supply high purity manganese sulfate, especially given the, given the increasing demand, which will lead to more supply chain issues. Experts have predicted that there will be shortages of this product in the upcoming years leading to a major supply deficit of five times the needed production by 2030. Our company is very well positioned to take on these challenges, literally given the strategic location of our Battery Hill property so close to the US border, which is located in Maine, near Maine. We are making positive steps towards accomplishing our mission, that of being the first exploration company to commercialize high-grade manganese in Canada and the United States. And thank you for listening, everybody. And back to you, Katrina. Thank you. In July, the company issued the first mineral resource estimate for its Battery Hill project, which consisted of 34.86 million tons in the measured and indicated categories, grading 6.42% manganese, plus an additional 25.91 million tons in the inferred category, grading 6.66% manganese, using a 2.5% cutoff grade that reflects total operating costs having reasonable prospects for economic extraction. Sensitivity analysis of the Battery Hill deposit to cutoff grade indicates 12.25 million tons of measured and indicated mineral resources at 8.77% manganese and 10.61 million tons of inferred mineral resources grading 9.05% manganese utilizing a cutoff grade of 7% manganese. The company's subsidiary Disruptive Battery Corporation is working on the development of an HVAC air purification delivery system for cleaner and healthier air, aiming to mitigate COVID-19 and other contaminants on surfaces and in the air. The shares are currently trading at 33.5 cents. For more information, please visit the company's website at manganesexenergycorp.com. Contact Martin Kepman, CEO, at 514-802-1814 or by email at martin at I'm Katrina Cotton for Investment Pitch Media.